Konnichiwa, Watashi no Namai Strong Windows. Before we start this video guys, be sure to subscribe to the channel and also be sure to follow me on Instagram for up to even more. Let's go! <laughs> hey guys, it's your boy Strong Bean here and welcome to another unboxing. This time we got something a little bit different and special. And this is actually like a sponsored video. A good friend of mine from Germany actually bought this for me. Uh, she ordered me some Japanese snacks for me to try out. So very excited. I think I never had Japanese snacks before. She ordered actually from worldofsweets.de, German websites. And they have lots of great stuff. I seen that selection of American stuff and they have very cool American stuff, a lot of American stuff. So <laughs> to the person who bought me this, if you want to do this again next time, let's try out some American stuff. But yeah, so I'm very excited. It's been a lot of trouble for this to get to me because we had problems with the delivery and stuff because of coronavirus. But yeah. Now it's here, finally. I hope everything is okay still. So let's just see. Oh, and here's a shout out to the World of Sweets at because this package got sent back once because there was nobody there at the address that we sent this to. And they sent it back like we were in contact with them. And they were very kind, they responded immediately and they sent it back, so it was awesome. So shout out to World of Sweets at the I'll put the link in the description for you to get, for you guys to check them out. But yeah, so oh, we got a lot of stuff here. What the hell? Fourteen things are in here. Whoa. Okay. Okay, I'm not gonna read what's in there. <laughs> I wanna be surprised, but I mean, look at this, guys. I won't be able to try this on one video. Like in one go. Oops. Like, I will put everything in one video, of course, but it will take quite some time to try everything. So, what we got here? We got a 10 euro gift card for roast markets a 30 euro gift card for some wine <laughs> get to the snacks okay i guess i'll take this out first what is this inva asian snacks kabuki rice crackers spicy so i see this they are hot hot rice crackers okay I wonder how hot it is. Like, it's like 10 in the morning, so I'm not gonna eat like something spicy right now. So I'll try this later today. Oh, here's one thing I always want to try it's a uh, green tea Kit Kat. Looks very weird. Ooh, the smell. A very strong green tea smell. Wow. Like you got the green tea, but it doesn't mix well with the Kit Kats. Oh, next up, mm. I got some. I got nothing to drink here. So what's this? Hello Panda, biscuits with milk flavored filling. Looks nice, the box. Okay, I want to try this. <laughs> oh, wow.
Look at him! No, no, this is not for you. Okay, I have another one. Wow! You did really good. Very nice. Right there. So we'll take this one out. Sweet potato snack. So I'm definitely not going to try this now. I'll try this later while watching something on Netflix, I guess. Sweet potato snack. This. Got here. What's this? Some Pop Tarts. This is American. Probably based in the USA. Pop Tarts Frosted Cinnamon Roll. This is definitely American. This is not Japanese. I'm gonna try this now. Frosted Cinnamon Roll Pop Tart. I never had. No, I think I never had a Pop Tart before. I think this is gonna be the first time. Oh, these are huge. Okay, I'm not gonna try that now. I'll try it later. What's this? Red hot cinnamon flavored candy. Oh no. Brief fire. Why? Is this real like really really hot? Oh no. So she ordered me like Japanese and American stuff. That's nice. Oh no, I'm scared of these. I might take like try one to end the video. Oh no, <laughs> I'm a bit scared. Pokey! I've seen Pokey before. Never tried Pokey though. But I've seen Pokey before. Like at like, some random Japanese or Chinese markets. Like you like every country has their Chinese stores. And I've seen Pokey before the uh, mango flavor. This looks nice. Let's try that. So here it is. Oh wow! The mango smell. That's awesome. Wow, it really smells like a fresh mango. Mm. Wow. It's awesome. I have another one. Oh my god, so good. That's awesome. Show me a lot of stuff. What's this? Walker's Highlander Shortbread. Okay. This is from Scotland. What's this? A Dumo? Dumo? Snacks? Wait, how did it Yeah, there are a few languages. There's like Finnish, Swedish. So this is from Scandinavia. At the northern region of Europe. For those of you who are not good at geography. Yeah, Helsinki, Finland. Okay, so she got me from various countries. That's awesome. Hey, we got Scotland, Japan, USA. I got Finland. That's awesome. Wow. I was definitely not expecting that. Thank you so much. <laughs> A Nestle Caramac. This is from Switzerland. From the Switzerland. Nestle. I'm not really a fan of caramel. Okay, got some paper. So what you got here? I know takeoff. Take off color mix, I know this. I've had this before. I guess it has been years, oh my god, but I've had take off before. And I am thirsty, so. So but there's another can. Let's see what's it, what's it. Okay, it's a bottle. Okay, I have the can. And yes, it's cold by the way. Yeah. 
I had this before. Cola, it's like engineering and cola. It's been years since I had this. That's cool. Cheers. And last but not least, we got a bottle here. And it is. What the fuck is this? So, this. Uludagazos. From Turkey. This is Turkish. Turkish product. Uludag. Gazos Uluda Gazos This one is warm actually so I'm not gonna try this now Yeah, I'm very excited to try this Even legendary Uluda Gazos So, let's just recap what we got here So we got the Uluda Gazos From Turkey We got Pop Tarts Frosted Cinnamon Roll From the United States we got some Nesca Caramac from the Switzerland. Oh, Switzerland. Sorry for saying that, but I, I love saying that right now. Uh, we got Dum Dumle snacks from uh, Finland. We got the Walker's Shortbread Highlander from Scotland. Sorry. That's the takeoff. We got tea takeoff from Germany. Takeoff is from Germany. We got the uh, Japanese green tea Kit Kat, which, sorry, but I don't like it. I got the Pokey mango flavor, awesome. These are really good. We got my, f I think that's my favorite so, like, so far. But from the ones I tried right now, I think this one, this one is my favorite. Hello Panda biscuits with milk flavored filling. That's they are awesome. We got the red toss that I will try right now. I hope they are. I'm a bit scared. And we got the Kabuki spicy rice crackers, which I'm also excited to try. I'm gonna try this later. So let's try these red hot cinnamon flavor candy. These are also from the States. Uh, no, actually, it's a product of Mexico. Oh, Mexico! Okay, oh no, it's from Mexico, so they are really hot. Look at this. Small red like m -Dams. What? I'm scared. Okay, here yeah, goes nothing. Okay, cinnamon. Okay, I'm liking it so far. I right, cinnamon flavor. They're yeah, good, but not hot. Like, really not hot. Like, a kid could eat this. Okay, yeah, right. That's pretty much it. So, I'll see you in the following clips when I try the rest of it. So, see you in a bit. Hey there, so I'm editing the video right now. And yeah, I did a little snack. I'm gonna try out these Kabuki rice crackers. Let's go. Oh. Smells like rice with curry. I feel rice back. Like you know those like like rice biscuits, rice cakes. Like that you eat when you're on a diet or something, you can eat those. They taste like that, but like with um, spices to it. Very nice. I like it. It's slightly as spicy, but yeah, it's not that spicy. Like it tingles a bit in your mouth with the other tongue and stuff. But it's alright. And I'm used to eating spicy stuff. I like spicy food. But yeah, they're actually very nice. Shake these out. Shake these out if you can. 
Kabuki. So yeah, guys, let's try the rest of the things. So we got not much left to try. Um, actually, I'm not gonna try these right now. The um, the walk is high on the shortbread because they look like normal cookies, like biscuits that's drinking coffee. So I'm not gonna try these right now because I think I'm, I think I've eaten this already, so I know it's just normal biscuits. But I'm gonna try this one. Uh, I don't actually like caramels, so it's all broken in pieces. Okay, it's white. Caramel. It's actually good. Like, it doesn't really taste like caramel. It's like white chocolate. It smells like caramel, but it tastes like white chocolate. That's weird. That's it's good. That's a caramel from the Switzerland. <laughs> okay, that's that. Uh, next, I'm gonna try the Dumle snacks, or Dumle, or however you pronounce it, uh, from uh, Finland. So yeah. Oh yeah, that's how it works. Like normal, like chocolate bar. It's weird. Super weird. It has biscuits, caramel, chocolate. It's really weird. Is that right? Hmm. Dumbly snacks. Okay. And the last thing was the uh, Pop Tarts. So I'm just gonna bite into one. I'm not gonna eat the whole thing here. Good that. Mm. Wow. I can see them in a row. I can imagine eating this. Hot. Cold? Yes. I can test you can put it in the freezer. I might try it, but hot. Mm -mm. That's, right. That's awesome. Wow. Very surprised. I know there are tons of pop tarts flavor. This is the first one, and I like it. It's very good. Yeah. So let's wash it down with some Uludak gazos. The Turkish thing that was in the package. Wow, a lot of carbonation. Tastes like there's a drink called Guarana Antarctica, and it tastes like that, makes it Sprite. Guarana is a fruit from Brazil, I think. But it's pretty good. So, like, it's not ice cold, it's kind of cold. I think ice cold should be perfect. So, I'm gonna put this in the, fr in the fridge and enjoy it later. It's very good. Oh, duck, it was awesome. Okay, <laughs> guys, that's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed this unboxing slash taste test of these. Snacks from all around the world. Uh, at the beginning, I thought it would be only Japanese snacks, but it turned out to be from all around the world. So we have Japan, we got Scotland, Switzerland, Finland, USA, Mexico, and of course Turkey and Germany. And yeah, if you want to see more like this, let me know down in the comments, and uh, we'll make it happen. So yeah guys, thanks for watching, like always leave a like, a comment, and subscribe to the channel, that's the most important part. See you next time, bye.